has been an incredible end to a hard-fought game. How was it from your side? Disappointing not to to get the three points because it was a tough game and when we were ahead in the score, you know, to 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 lose two points in the injury time, it it hurts, you know, because I think uh, the atmosphere was amazing uh, in our tough moments in the game. The crowd was behind and you know we were close for to the victory, so it, it, it hurts to, to lose two points in, in this way. Tactically, it was a fascinating battle, wasn't it? And the manager obviously changed things quite early. How did that change the dimension of the game, bringing cover on? Yeah, I think uh, in the first 30 minutes, um, we couldn't get close to the ball. Uh, when we had the ball, we didn't have many options. You know, credit to them as well, because uh, they were they were... They were well settled in, in the, in the, on the pitch, and you know we tried to readjust. And, and I think after we, we got closer to the ball, we, we could move the ball better. And you know even though we didn't create a lot of chances, but we had some dangerous situations, and it was a, a tough game that both teams we had our moments. Was it the type of game you were expecting? Because they're always close matchups, aren't they? When, when Chelsea and United face off. Yeah, always, always is. It's a, it's a fixture that is, is hard, but uh, they were coming uh, with the confidence from the last results. Uh, we, we, we are having a crazy schedule where we are playing every three days, so we have to, to make uh, the most of it. And, you know, I think it was important as well from, from the fans uh, that they recognize that, that uh, they were behind uh, us from the start to, to the end. So all together i think is what we is required now in in this period and hopefully we can keep going the team is working hard and and hopefully after the the last two draws we we face salzburg and, mm. and we get uh, we can get uh, the three points and the qualification for the next round you mentioned the schedule it is incredible i mean you you guys look dead on your feet at the end of that match and then you travel on monday play again on tuesday how difficult is it to recover and prepare when games are coming this quickly uh, it's, is what it is. First of all, uh, you know, it's something that uh, we cannot lose a lot of energy or getting mentally weak because uh, co because of complaints about the schedule is what it is. And mm -hmm. and I think all the effort and the energy has to go towards a uh, good recovery. I think we are all professionals. We know what we can do to 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 get uh, in conditions for a game, and that's what we have to do. Uh, as soon as the game finishes, we have all. Uh, all uh, the options for us to to recover and, and and tomorrow as well and then we are back on on the plane <laughs> so. finally let's end on a positive you mentioned the atmosphere how important are the fans what bigger role do they play in a game like this because they were fantastic weren't they yeah uh, they play a big role because you know i think that energy we 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 need that you know from everybody when when we are playing here at the bridge uh, especially when you have uh, every game, uh, every, every three days a game, uh, you know, we have a couple of injuries, so we, we, we have to stick together and, and in moments where, where the game can be a bit out of our control to feel the, the energy from them, the support, that I think that it gives a, a lift for everybody on the pitch and, and I think it's very important. They, they, they were amazing, they have been always and, and hopefully we can, we can give them uh, happy moments.